Ok, on commence dans 3, 2, 1, go! Hey Monica! So last weekend, a bunch of the strong jugglers and I went up to Canada for the 10th annual Turbo Fest! It's this huge juggling festival that lasts all weekend and there are amazing workshops and performances, just amazing juggling stuff for three whole days. So I drove up there with Steven. Say hi. Hello. And Eric. Say hi, Eric. Oh. <laughs> hi, Eric. Here we are in Canada. And then we kept driving until we got to Quebec City. We arrived at the Circus School of Quebec. It's this old church that they pimped out to be more circusy. So we get there, and there's juggling upstairs, and there's juggling downstairs, and that's where the strong jugglers were hanging out. Say hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Why does everyone keep doing that to me? Downstairs is also where we sleep at night. So it's everyone piled into this one room with sleeping bags, and some people have air mattresses and tents. And sometimes you end up sleeping right next to a snoring guy. <laughs> So that was a fun first night. So anyway, I thought I'd make this video about juggling trivia so we could test your juggling knowledge. And that way I could get into all the fun things that happened over the weekend. So here we go. First question. True or false? Jugglers juggle to carnival music like you always see in films. False. If you think that we juggle to music like this. completely wrong. Instead, it's more like this. Yeah, we like to think we're cool. Sometimes we're pretty badass, though. Second question. True or false? Jugglers are either nerds or hippies. So first of all, you have all of the U of R jugglers, which, nerds, and you also have some hippies. <laughs> there are lots of dreadlocks, especially from French Canada for some reason. Some of us are both nerds and hippies. We could really call us a herd of... nippies? That doesn't sound right. Third question! True or false? This object is called a pin. False! Nothing makes a herd of nippies more angry if you call a juggling club a pin. We do not juggle things you bowl with. Fourth question. True or false? Clubs and balls are the only things you can juggle with. False. If your answer true, you clearly weren't paying attention to the beginning of this video. Of course you have your clubs and your balls. You also have your rings. And your hats. You have your hoops. Your kandama. Your diablo. Just to name a few. Sometimes jugglers also juggle things that shouldn't actually be juggled, such as toilet paper, or water bottles, or candy. And of course, I can't forget to mention unicycles, even though they're not juggling unicycles, they're riding them, but it's still circusy. Over the weekend, Eric and I also worked a lot on Partner Boy, and although I did not have footage from when we did that at Turbo, I have footage from earlier. So it looks something like this. So, clubs and balls, not everything there is. Fifth question. True or false? Juggling is cooperative, not competitive. False. There was actually a whole section of the festival devoted to competitions. You have your eyes closed juggling. You have your A-club endurance. 
I don't even know how many rings they're juggling right now, but ring endurance. You have your balancing. It gets pretty intense. At night at Turbo, there's a game we play called Combat. Basically, the aim of Combat is to juggle three clubs while trying to knock your opponent's clubs out of the air. I don't have footage myself because the first two nights I went to sleep too early and the third night they didn't do it. But I found this awesome video on YouTube from last year. There's also a game we play called Volley Club. Basically for Volley Club, you have two teams, each of two people, and then you have your Volley Club. So each person starts with two clubs, except for the server, who starts with their two clubs and the volley club. So the volley club gets served over to the other team, who has to pass it back. And the team who drops the volley club loses the point, so the other team gets the point. So there's some different strategies to this game. Some teams are so good that they can set and spike the volley club, just like you would do in volleyball. But you can also just try to throw the club to the other team with a really crazy spin so they have no hope of catching it. All in all, it takes some amazing teamwork and it's actually quite competitive. Some teams even have a sort of war dance they use before the round to intimidate their opponents. But really, even though we're competitive, we're competitive in a friendly way. Question 6. True or false? Juggling tricks in competitions often involve stripping. True. Ah ouais, arrête tes pantalons, arrête de faire du show. <rire> Nathan, we're not in it anymore. We're not in it, Nathan. <rire> combat. Est-ce qu'on devrait juste faire un combat? Ah, oh, ceux qui ont des... Ah, there's one, il y a quelqu'un qui n'a pas. Faut qu'il en mette, faut qu'il en mette. Why? Why? <laughs> I still haven't seen a unicycle stripper team, but it, it could be done. Question 7. Final question. True or false? Jugglers are really serious people at heart. <laughs> no? <laughs> false. Just watch. One more time, because it's really cute. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> okay, fuck you all, we go like this. <laughs> And I hoped you learned a lot about juggling. And yeah, Turbo was just a lot of fun. See you next week.